Hey guys, Xana here, and today I'm going to show you a tutorial how to run any CD without the actual CD. Now, what exactly do I mean? Well, let's say that you got a brand new game, and you do not want, you hate the fact that you have to boot it with the actual CD because of piracy reasons, and you wish there was a way around that. I figured it out, and I'm going to show you guys today. So first, you're going to need two programs, and that would be Image Burn and Virtual Clone Drive. And now, what you want to do is insert your desired CD. Today, I'm going to be using Star Wars Battlefront 2, because that is one of the games that, sadly, you have to have a CD in order to boot it. Closing the drive. Next, you want to press Image Burn. Loading. Then you want to create image from file. I mean, yeah, create image from create file from image disk whatever the fucking button's called I don't care next you want to press this little button here and then save the ISO wherever you would like preferably your desktop then when you're ready you press this button and then it starts reading the disk then after that let me just eject the disk to show you that this is actually real and I'm not bullshitting you it's ejecting there it goes there it goes, ejecting, da 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 da. Alright. Next, what you want to do is open up the folder where your game is at. Next, you want to right click, go to properties, and right where it says, oh wait, ah, right click properties. Come on, damn it. There we go. Where it says open with, what you want to do is change this to virtual clone drive. Now, just a note that the actual folder is actually named something different. It's actually named Elaborate Bytes. I'm pretty sure this is the company's name, but if you click it, there's virtual clone. Then what you want to do is press VCD mount, then press open, then press OK, and then apply. Then double click it as you normally would like any other program, and it should boot or load and there you go now if I actually open if I open the game itself it screw up cam studio so this is where I have to say goodbye I'll see you guys later bye bye